This is gonna be really bad. Oh. Welcome to my arena and my boxing gloves. Today, I'm gonna see what you're made out of. And I know that you're made out of flesh and, and soft squishy parts, but I'm gonna see if they can hold up to my standards with my boxing gloves. I don't think he enjoyed that too much. What about you then? You've got a bow and an arrow. You're all you're all tough and whatnot. Well, <laughs> wow! I'm actually quite surprised that you took that like such a man. Oh, no! Stop it! No! No foul language. You're not allowed to say anything like. Oh my god! These gloves are not really that powerful against you know this part, but they're really powerful against the knee. <laughs> oh, they're so good against the knee, aren't they? They will bring them. Wham! And boom! He's still screaming over there. Goodbye. You know what we do to screaming people? We take my all powerful hand and we yeet them across the universe. There we go. Goodbye! You should, of course, ignore all of these guys. I did some experiments before I, uh, I showed up to these guys. And uh, they have some protective equipment on. For good reason! Because I've got a frag grenade. <clears throat> Uh, it should hurt a lot, and um, they might or might not feel some pain. Uh, so just without further ado, let's just pull the. All right, now here's the here's the question: Will it explode automatically, or do I have to throw it? That guy just got up. You know what we do to him, huh? I was gonna save this grenade for you, but we're gonna put in on him. There we go. Okay, run away, run away, run away! Don't hurt me too much. Oh my god! Ooh, I see that guy got some damage. It's fine though. I've got two more test subjects and just the oh, <clears throat> and just the and just the tool for the job. Now, you might think this is an ordinary dagger, but oh, you'd be wrong. This is a teleporting dagger. I just grabbed it by my teleporting dagger. You see like that? So I can whoosh up and then get it back to me. Oh, wait, what? Did I just teleport? I think I teleported. Let's try that again. Here we go. Hmm. Okay, so unless it sticks into them, I will not teleport. You better take this like a man, buddy. Huh. Oh, huh. there we go. I got it. Hi. Into the jugular. I did not sign up for this. Well, this is called the Pillar of Gods, and you've just arrived to it. And you say that you didn't sign up for it? You sure did. You little useless, stupid, armor-wearing dum-dum. <clears throat> right then, I want to find out one thing. If... Your kneecaps are soft. Mm. Mm. That's gonna sting a little bit, I'm assuming. Is that? Yeah, I'm just gonna leave that there because I wanna try something else. This, this is a shotgun, okay? And it's not any shotgun. It's actually Wastelander's shotgun and I can shoot stuff with it. And it'll, it'll, it'll shoot like flame bullets and whatnot. This is really cool. You know what's also really cool? That cool guys don't look at explosions. <laughs> This thing is really powerful, and it's also got a little bit of a sticky bit at the front here. You see this? It goes through armor if I poke it hard enough. Wait, does it? Oh, it does, yeah. And then it sticks into you like that, and when it sticks into you, I can grab it and shoot it. Oh, Oi, gods, bring me some new test subjects, please. Oh, hello there. Oh, <laughs> you've all got different kinds of weapons on you. Yes, this is perfect. This is perfect. Because I've got more stuff where that came from. Not this one, but this one. Oh yeah! It even says here, dehumanize yourself and face to bloodshed. And that's exactly what I'm gonna do. Now this is not an ordinary blade. It's got a little bit of a pointy bit at the front here, or back, or in the handle, uh, because they can't handle it. So with this thing, if I press a button, it'll extend. <gasps> wow! And then it'll slowly retract, and then I go, no, I can extend it again. And you know what that can do? <laughs> oh, oh, well that was slightly worrying. But it does work. Um, does it? Okay, I need to, I need to watch. Oh, whoops, sorry, sorry. Did I discombobulate you? I think I did. Oh, but that's good. He's, he has his eyes closed, which, which tells me that he's just slightly unconscious. Everything's okay. He's gonna get back up in a jiffy. And if he doesn't, oops. Okay, here we go then. Let's just, let's just put this in your stomach a little bit like this. And then let's activate it. Oh, it comes out through it comes through him. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, now it's gonna fall out. Oh, and he I think he bled out. So this guy will for sure not get back up, but he might. 
Thanks for the adjustment. Do you take cash or credit? For what adjustment? Taking care of them? What are you talking about? This, though, has a blade as well that you probably saw. There you go. That should take care of him. Yoink. I suggest you pull out that shield right now. Otherwise, I'm going to fling this teleporting arrow into your face. And it didn't even teleport. Ta-da! Magic trick. It was only a bluff. It was only a bluff. Taste my feet. Taste them. Sometimes you've just got to take a look at the ordinary things and make them unordinary. Like this little um, stick with um, some climbing things on it. Now, this is meant to climb walls and, and uh, mountains and whatnot, but I'm gonna climb into your brain, just like that. And that's the way it works. Um, I, th I think I, I think I did, I, I think I did a good thing. Now, the cool thing about this is we can actually, we can stick it into something and we can activate it and that'll, that'll freeze it into place and we can climb stuff. But I, I tried to like freeze it into his skull and rip his brain out, but it didn't, <sighs> didn't work. This little thing looks like something out of a children's toy book. And I'm assuming it's gonna work like one as well. So I'm just gonna, just gonna put it gently across your, what? Sorry, sorry. Oh, whoops, oh God, oh, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean, I didn't mean, I didn't mean to do it. I didn't, I didn't mean to do it. So we're just gonna, oh, you opened your eyes again. Welcome back to reality. Oop, there goes gravity <laughs> in, his, in his face. Right, gently, gently. Here we go, put it gently around his neck. Just twist it a little bit and, uh-oh. I might have hit the jugular. It made a sound that you might you might pass out soon. And if you do, I'm really sorry. But don't forget to subscribe to Wacky. Here we go. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I want it to go. I want it to go around your neck like some sort of a side. It doesn't work. You can. Ha oh, you're not dead. Compl just went through him. Are you immortal? Let's find out, shall we? No, he's not immortal. He's just levitating. <laughs> Fuses beard. <gasps> Oh, these are all Apex things. These are all Apex things! What? What's this? A book? <laughs> you know what you should do? You should read a book like this. I think, I don't know what this is. It looks like some sort of a holy thing. Uh, you can open it and it's got like a, bl uh, a, a light circle and a dark circle in it. Do you see these things? Do they make any sense to you? No? Oh, I can't even, what? The book, the book doesn't do anything. It just, it's useless. You there! You should never bring a sword to a gunfight. Whoops, oh, I missed. Please reload. It's actually, it's actually like a flint block pistol. Come on, please, please, please. Ooh. Come on, Ugh. son of a, mm. you think you can handle me? I might not hit you with it, but, I, what the? I might not hit you with it, but I can still discombobulate. This is not even accurate, not even a little bit. Look, I'm, I keep missing him. Come on then, taste it. What the, ow, Ugh. taste it. Ugh. It got stuck in his, <gasps> You guys see that? Cause I, I sure did. Look, look at this. The ball got stuck in them. <laughs> it's actually a ball that sticks. <laughs> and I know exactly where I want it to stick. Butt plug. Did you like it? I don't think you did. Hmm, that did not work at all. Oh, there we go. Perfect. It did work. Nice plate. Nice, nice pistol. This is a caltrop, and I can make many of them appear and I'm gonna put them in front of me and we're gonna have some random NPC run towards us in a haze and he's not gonna be able to see what hit him because he's just gonna be you know he's just gonna be focused on me what oh they keep okay they keep disappearing it's fine here we go then all right one angry NPC come oh god hell drop ah! what did I do I, I what did I do I don't know what I did I spawned this thing and everything just went oh god oh no oh boy no just go Goodbye! Look at him with his bow and arrow, thinking that he can hit me. Oh, that was actually pretty close. All right then, here we go. I've got this, which has got, it's, it's a hook with a rope on it. Mm. Oh, I'm gonna tangle you in the rope and there's nothing you can do about it. <laughs> can I actually make him maybe, maybe like, you know, fall over if I put the rope behind his legs and like, oh, it doesn't work, but this works. It doesn't work, okay. Oh, that was, oh, I can swing it. I can swing it. Oh! Taste my meat hook, you little useless arrow wielding. Oh. <sighs> speeding it up, speeding it up. There we go. I got him. <laughs> I got him. Oh, that's amazing. Woo! This is actually pretty cool. This <laughs> the way I can just smack him in the face, and there's nothing you can do about it because I'm out of his reach. There we go. I think I got him. Woo! But just to make sure, we're gonna just get up. Ooh, a mage has appeared. Well, I'm a mage as well of some sort. I've got a lantern here. Didn't expect that one, did you? Yeah, nobody expects the lantern to hit you in the face. But it does. It's a really deadly lantern. <laughs>
Oh, well, 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 look who's back from the dead. Well, you didn't actually die. Well, that, that I know, but you're about to die because I've got a chain thing that has a lock uh, at the end here. Um, and this looks like it could hurt if I just swing it like this a lot, like a helicopter, and then I smack in the face with it. Oh, God. There we go. And after a little bit, he's just going to pass out. Come on. Come on. There we go. <laughs> Yee, that's what happens to you when you try to handle the pain. <laughs> hey, guess what I have? I've got a torch with your name on it. Yeah. Oh, wait, it worked. It burns him. You think it'll burn me? You might have a sword and some armor on, but you don't have this. A, uh, a ar 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 arbalest or something. I, I don't know. How do I, how do I load this? Hmm. I think I need some ammo for it. Be right back. I'm back and I've got one. It's really big, this one. How do, do I just put it? Oh, snap. Oh, no. This is not, this is going to be really bad. This is going to be really bad. Oh, oh. <laughs> I just hit him straight. It went straight. This, this is cool. Oh, this is cool. Oh, I want to shoot somebody. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Straight in the back. Oh, I see. He's a mage. He's a mage. That's what makes him so. There we go. Straight through his face.